Hello and welcome to another lesson in this course. Today we are going to learn about what is Tosca, what are the different features of Tosca which makes it a popular automation tool. We'll look at all the different components which form the Tosca test automation suite and we'll also look at how Tosca differs from another popular web automation testing tool which is Selenium. So let's start off by learning more about Tosca. In simple terms, Tosca is a scriptless AI based no code automation tool for end to end test automation. So in Tosca, without writing a single line of code or script, you can automate any type of application, be it a web application, a mobile application, desktop application, or you can also automate API based applications. It uses artificial intelligence and different technologies to identify all the elements on your application. Also, it is a continuous testing platform that delivers fast feedback for agile and DevOps. So you can integrate your Tosca test automation suite with a CI CD tool like Jenkins, which will deliver fast feedback for your agile development teams. And it will also help you to integrate your testing with the CI CD pipeline in a DevOps environment. Tosca allows us to design functional automated end to end software test across all layers of the enterprise architecture. And what I mean is you can design manual tests, automated tests, API tests, and a lot more across all the layers of your application, be it the front end, back end, or the API layer. It also provides real time risk assessment with business focused actionable results. So what you can do with Tosca is you can do a risk assessment. So you can create your business requirements and then you can put a weightage on each requirement and then they could be linked to different test cases and your test reports through which you can measure the risk of all your test cases in a particular release. It also ensures availability of appropriate test data at any time. So Tosca uses test data management through which it can store all the different test cases and the test data which is available at any point of time. You can either store it in the same database where Tosca is running or you can also set up an external database for your test data management. Tosca also helps you to simulate the behavior of dependent systems if they are unavailable during your test execution. So this is done with the help of service virtualization, which is also provided by Tosca, through which you can emulate any particular system and its behavior so that in case it is not available, you can still go ahead with your test execution. Now let's look at some of the features which Tosca provides. So Tosca provides you with risk based testing, which means you can track your requirements based on the risk weightage. Also, you can perform load testing on your applications using the Tosca. You can perform all the activities which are part of test management, like defining your requirements, tracking your requirements, performing risk analysis, and a lot more. You can also manage your test data in different databases, either external or on the same database. You can do manual testing, and also exploratory testing, which is provided by Tosca. You can also perform API testing using the Tosca automation tool. 
you can do a lot of different analysis and analytics on different data and test cases you can take advantage of bi and big data while doing all of these analysis as i explained earlier we can do exploratory testing and we can also integrate tosca into a continuous integration tool like jenkins we can do service virtualization which means even though our applications are not available we can still perform testing on these applications which are emulated by tosca we can do impact analysis with the risk based testing now let's look at some of the tosca components so tosca commander is the main component which enables easy creation management execution and analysis of the automation test cases then there is tosca executor which helps us to execute the test cases on different test objects there is also tosca x scan which basically scans the application and saves the technical information of all the elements in different modules which is then used to identify and steer the screen items we have also got the test repository in tosca which helps us to manage the test data needed for all the test execution now let's talk about what's the difference between tosca and one of the most popular automation tools which is selenium the first difference which you will notice is selenium is an open and free tool but tosca is a licensed and paid tool tosca is completely codeless which means you don't need to write any code in order to automate any application but in selenium it's a complete code based tool right so you have to use some language in order to write your scripts tosca supports all types of applications be it web desktop or mobile but selenium supports only web applications there is a dedicated support team for tosca if you come across any issues or re require any help but in selenium you will only have to fall back on community support tosca comes with inbuilt reporting and object repository features but there is no such feature for reporting an object repository in selenium web driver tosca is built upon model based test automation while selenium is a script based test automation right so in selenium you have to write all the scripts in order to execute the test cases but in tosca you can build different modules through which you can drive your automation tosca also supports api and load testing but there is no such support for selenium out of the box for api or load testing so these are all the differences between tosca and selenium so both have their own disadvantages and advantages and then uh, you have to decide based on the budget uh, the types of applications and uh, what are the skill sets of your team members based on which you want to decide on which automation tool is best for your application. 